I think a lot of strangers have an issue with the way that I look. Um, not all of them, but I, I just get this sense, you know, like a third sense. You can feel, you can feel when someone's someone has an issue with you. It can be little things from being being on the bus and sitting down and watching people like not sit next to you. Like <laughs> they just don't want to sit next to you. And I know that that could offend loads of people but I get so, I get so offended and I'm like, well why don't you want to sit next to me? What's wrong with me? People definitely feel like they have a right um, to tell you that you're you're unhealthy and you're you're not helping society rather than people sitting you down and telling you that you're you know you've got a problem here they bully you <laughs> there is there is no there's no sympathy for anyone that is overweight and i'm not asking for sympathy um but there's there's no sort of niceness about it it's just you're disgusting you shouldn't have done that to yourself. You are, you are, I guess, out of control. I can control myself. You can't. You're disgusting. That's basically the underlying <laughs> thing of it. You can't objectify someone for being less than human and deciding that you can just attack them. The, the issue is, is behavioural issues and how people feel like they can treat certain people. I definitely don't see me in <laughs> any films of any films will stop really um, and when I say me um, when I think of me I don't just think of me as someone that's overweight I see myself as a woman I see myself as a black woman I see myself as a black overweight woman and the only person I can think of is that girl from Precious and bless her but <laughs> you know like where, where is where is anyone else um, and there's different levels of of blackness and overweightness like you can't just have, well, well, we've got her, she, she's black, she's overweight. There should be a range of them. The worst thing that you could ever be is overweight. And I think that's really, really, really sad because, like, there's so much more worse things that I would want to be than this. Maybe because I'm living it, I don't know. <laughs> but I just, I just, and, and, I, and it makes me think, why is that the worst thing? Is it because... As soon as you're overweight, you're unattractive, or as soon as you're overweight, you deserve to be bullied. Like, what? What are these things? When you start taking that goal to like actually try and love yourself, you realise that you're actually quite happy the way that you are. Or well, I realised that, um, and then I didn't want to strive to be the size eight <laughs> or you know whatever, because because there's more to life than how you look. There's so much more, like. When you get there, you realise that and you're like, why why am I putting pressure on myself to be to be this person that I probably never will be just because it won't make me happy? Like, why am I striving for that? I just I just need to love myself for who I am, whatever I may be.